Hello and welcome. Right, I got a bit carried away. I was just driving away and thought, uh, have you actually hit record yet? And I thought, uh, no, no, I haven't. So, yes, I'm uh, starting the second leg of the grabbing off the field and taking to market. So, I am going to go straight into a time match because this is a bit of a whopper. It really is. Now, I knew it was going to be. And I was still, I just was debating inwardly, do I hire someone like the Seventh And I thought, it's too long. You not, can't get in the middle of the village. And I thought, all you do is lease a dirty tunnel. And to be honest, you've got two 15 odd tools. So it's still 30 tools. So I thought, it's about right. It's a long trek. That's what's new in it. Because I normally say that, yeah, it's the distance and how far you are, but it also, sometimes this is true also, that you've just got to do what you've got to do. It is just a tool. It really is what it is. So, in a way, yeah, I've just got to get used to it and be a bit more patient. Right, anyway, I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
thought that was never going to end. I really did. That was... Ooh. I didn't... Ah. Okay, that didn't quite end up. How are you? Land. I apologise for that. I was trying to end the 33. I thought we really need to grab these if we're going to, like, yeah, shift down the bottom. But one thing I was going to say, I was debating. I was thinking, this is a really good feel. And I thought, yeah, but it's sort of more in line with the actual story. In so much as village life is everything, really, in sort of Poland. So, yeah, to be in the village where we're sort of thinking about buying that is really important in this country. So, yeah, I thought, let's play it how it should be played. Yeah. No, then I'm not sure. Oh, no, no, we can. Yeah. No, of course, of course, it's not, they're not completely filled. But I thought it was about time we grabbed this lot off the edge of that field whilst the crop's not growing. We also need some fuel. I, yeah, with this having the... Uh, then we'll need to drop that off and stick that on the front again. And then we will... So we finished on 178,171, which is not... It is not a bad payday on hard economy. We would be doing absolutely phenomenal if we were on normal economy. We would have, that would be about 160 grand. It would be 160 grand. 78, about 85,000 we got for that little lot. So really, it's quite phenomenal. So, as one door closes, another door opens. Now I realise as well, this is totally, we really don't know what we're going to get. It could be the worst land in the entire map, but it's more about village life as buying Field 91 or Area 91, really. And still having 146,246 after the exchange is done. There's a lot of work to do, though. It's not, it's not fit for us to just wander in. But we have got the tractors and we've even got trailers. I plan on. There's not going to be a lot of wood chips because they're not none of. Them. There's only one big tree in the entire place. So next session be about us getting ready for this coming year and we need to plough and all sorts of things so we will buy a plough as well, a plough stroke launcher we're going to need to buy a seed and again I'm trying to stay in character with the area I'm, so for once I'm not waiting for sales or anything like that we're going to buy small equipment that would be bought in this area which is a departure from the door for myself. It's I wanted to play this as it should be played. I did to, to a degree on Zilonka, but it did wander a bit during the let's play. I did fall into habits of like yeah, buying the things from the sales and, and there's gotta be a little bit of that. You might hear of a, a special deal from foreign markets that uh, is really good, so we are the proud owners of that quite large patch of land. The other thing is we need to be... It has all been worked, so I just thought I'm going to have that bit of a chat. So we'll stick this here. We need to order some fuel, which we will order that right now. Yeah. It is amazing how both of those came in the one grass pickup. It isn't actually a bad little thing and it's a small forage. Yeah, it is. We had it on, well, at least it actually. It's not going to break the bank, the 695. Yeah, and you could pick up straw. It could be an all-in-one really. As well as cutting the grass. That's what I'm thinking. That's a pickup, though, isn't it? Grass pickup, I believe. Yeah, it is just a pickup, so you'd cut it with a mower. And if you was going to do that, wouldn't you actually just get. That? Yeah, let's have a look. What? That does everything but grass. Let's have a look then at forage headers. Yeah, that's the pickup, but that really does just pick up. 
whereas the memory type ones are the direct disk this type they do everything that you need to do as well as picking it up so i think that's yeah my preferred one is the end one which is the the profit cut oh hang on no that is another one yeah oh hang on that does That does grass as well as all of the other things. It doesn't do corn. It's the one thing it doesn't do. Neither does that. Yeah, so the special corn ones, which are the... Yeah, like that one, really. That's just a pickup, as I said, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 8.30, right, yeah, 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 my bad. So we really have to hire two of them if we're going to do that. To cook grass, again, that's just a pick up. Yeah, it is. So what are we going to do? I think, I am tempted really, in a way. That's the one I was thinking, actually. That's the one. Oh, no, it wasn't, it isn't, actually. That's a point. I was not thinking about that. Now, I, I was not that blown away by it, really. The ore can. But it did have a bit of an update a while back. And again, it's in it's yeah in harmony with the... Right, we're going to be buying pallet fuel, I believe. One more, right, dear diesel barrels. Yes. Now then, we do need, we will need in the coming year, fertilizer. So we may as well, while we're in here, grab the fertilizer. And we also need a, a starter bag of lime. No, wrong one. That one. Just going to try to have one, but might need another one. And seeds, I believe we're going to definitely need as well. The picking pack, we're going to try for one. Going to be stingy. We're also going to need a big bag handler for the type of, yeah, that type of job, basically. So we're going to feature another one. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at prices. It's 250 the big bag handler from what I would always go for, the CSZ pack. But it's not always. If there's something that's as reasonable that is that type of thing, then we will give something else a chance. Yeah. Well, the lifting, that's another way of doing the same thing. Um, we've got that, and I know I can do it with it. Big bag transport route, which likewise, yeah, does the same thing. But again, it's it's five times the amount. So that's out. I'm not going to do that. Uh, that's mega expensive. It, it, you know, from a poor farmer's point of view, not it isn't mega expensive, but it is to us. So there we go. That, that's it. It really is the big bag handler wins by an absolute mile yeah which i did think it did but it's yeah you've got to try these things fantastic so that's that as well so we'll put that that on next session we should get this ready we also need to be looking to see what other fields? Not now, obviously, but yeah, just sort of. I want a field that's close by, but it's got to be, re you know, reasonable. Being as we're allowed to look at the bonuses on fields, and I'd like to go for one second. I mean, we're going to have to work the farmyard, even if it's lousy soil, at least for the initial, because we just can't afford. We're not that kind of farmer that can afford to do that. Now, we know these two are quite awful, because we've owned one. Yeah, 90 was 
not as bad as you think actually do you, but just yes yeah, sandy loam uh, oh, that one there is it's got a nice bonus isn't that the actual farmyard opposite i not i think this one here is yeah i think 60 that one there i think but it could be that one which would be 110,000 and has got a slight bonus that's terrible 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 okay so 59 is so far then one with any kind of bonus at all next door is not bad either that one's not bad at all and it is 123 that one's not bad so there's three in a row that aren't bad these are at the end of the village Ooh, that is a nice and it's a square field which you don't very oh there are some grass fields ah. I think we're going to buy field 87 as well for 70,103. Brilliant. So we've got one grass field, two. Excellent. All right, and that is where we're going to leave it. So we are down to 124,000. We have bought some provisions for next session. Let's stick that. So we're going to need, well, we don't need it, but we are going to use the big bag handler going to load that up next session we will pick up our sprayer i've not forgot oh another thing we're going to need again going for things that would be like in the area not only manufacturing now this is something i have thought about yeah i was talking about this a few sessions ago the inline drop spreader by dogface which can fertilize and light but it would mean it's going small but that's not really you could lime at the same time as well I don't know whether a worker could do it. We might need to test a little. It is a bit expensive for a poor farmer as well, actually. Yeah, it is a bit. I think that's why well, one of the other reasons when I looked at it, I thought, oh, wow. Because I suppose it is the equivalent to one of these. So, yeah, I suppose it is. Is it really? Right, so. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to go for this one, which I really like a lot. Gonna like ask the brother in law to spray it a nice colour. I think. I think I've had it silver before. I'm gonna go metal, I think, with that one. Yeah, that is actually quite nice. Yes. And if we're gonna do that, we're also gonna do something a little bit special. Yeah, we're going to go for an act. Actually, I was thinking about this earlier. There's something I haven't got in in on my active boxes. I've got the Jask and not used that for a long, long time because it's again, it's a bit like the Samurai. It's a big capacity, and it just wouldn't be possible to put it on the front of a tractor. Yeah, as I found out a long time ago, it's not a it's a back box really. The MX now that is a front box. But for us, it's a little bit expensive. Yeah, there is. Well, I'm going to buy one of these anyway. So, but there is another mod that I'd like to put in that's going to sort of suit us. We're going to need to, yeah, we're not going to need to lease a um, one of these for a while, though. Yeah, the Samurai is too big. These ones, the yeah, rear platform, they're, again, it, it's the same as I'd, I'd buy the Samurai if I was going to do that type of thing. There's the Tremi for 950, which is good. Yeah, it is. But it's sort of, it's realistic in so much as you're actually, yeah, but this is the one I'm liking. And we're going to go capacity 8, 500, because that's all you can have if you want it to be active. Yeah. Fantastic. And that is... Yeah, I'm going to put another thing in as well, which is very similar to the Tremi. Yeah, I'm, well, it's a test more than anything. So these are the bits and bobs that we've got for now that we really, really do need. And it's not broken the bank. We will be looking for... 
cedars. I might have a look at the inline thingy. We might just do fertilizing with this one. So we shall see. But that is the end of an absolute monster session. We have bought two fields, one grass. And again, we shall go with um, equipment that is in the air. It won't be like big stuff or anything like that because it's just not in harmony with the map. And I'm trying to stick to this far more rigidly than I normally would. Right, so all that remains to be said for this session is thank you very much for watching. True, do hope you can stick with me on this journey. And I'm going to say goodbye. And now. Really seriously thinking about how I can make this work. Are we going to buy that? We might lease the Jaguar 695 to begin with, even though it's reasonable. So we are going to buy that. Also, I don't know if I ticked it as I came in, but there's a new mower. I just, I think I did. I'm sure I did. Oh, it's a bit, yeah, it's a bit out of our price range, really. I think if we're going to do that, we're going to go for the RDMR by Hulls FS. I do. I don't think it can be beaten. I mean, we can, but but that's only 2 metre, and that's a 3.4. If we're going to do the pickup, 3 metre pickup, then I think we will do that. And in time, we could also... Do we buy something like that and have a bigger... Do I've never actually had that. Splitter. Why on earth is a splitter? Oh, I like it. Oh, maybe it is. Plus trailer hitch. Why would you do a trailer hitch? Um, oh, oh, yeah. No, 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 no. I do. I get it. But you'd have to have a fairly big forage thing to actually pick it up. Do you know what? I actually quite like it as it is. And. We will go for, we have got the horsepower to actually do it. And then if we lease the thing, we'll just pick it up as well. So the RDMR, let's do it. I think we're going to go grey this to try to match. Uh, so that be white. Oh, that's a bit bright. Okay, let's make that chrome. Oh, actually, that does look quite nice. Yeah. Fantastic. So we've got the... Did we buy the grass pickup? Yes, we did. But I think we're going to buy that as well. If we're going to go for the 695 in time, I think we're going to buy that as well. Fantastic. There we go. So a bit of a spending spree. We're down to new farmer start money, 101,490. We've got all of our grass equipment... We obviously do need to, yeah, we've got a bit of fertilizer spreader, bits and bobs, fuel, fertilizer, lime, all of the seeds. Just need to decide on, let's have a look actually, yeah. I'm not going to rush this because, yeah, and I'm not, I am going to go for, there might well be three meters, I might go for four, but there is actually. Yeah, we've not long put this in actually, which I'm not sure if it's a seed or a planter. Let's have a look. It would be there. Yeah, there's that one, which is a three meter. The air sandwich, the gill, but that's not, yeah, really isn't. Montana's definitely not. Ah, the gamma. Yeah, this is the one I was thinking about. You've got a four meter version and a, oh, yeah, they've got that's it. You've got a yellow or black. And then you've also got the little 2.2 .2 meter version. And this is what I was saying about the inline spreader. The inline spreader, if you're going to use it, it, yeah, it's, it's obviously only seeding. Yeah, it's, so we will go for this. I think we'll buy two of them, if I'm going to be totally honest. And we're going to go for two of the, you can change the colors, actually. I actually quite like it, as is. It's not got an awful lot of space. Two of those and one more of those 
active boxes just to inc increase the storage a little bit on that. It's about, I would say it's about there. Ah, there, I knew there was some more of these. Yeah, the big back handlery type things. I just couldn't remember where they were because I've never had them. So, no, I think it's further on. Yeah, last thing, and then I really am going. But yeah, I, 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 I'm not going to say goodbye again because I've already said it, but I just thought I'd quick. Ah, it's just past here. Yeah. Now we went red last time. So let's try and do that again. No, in fact, that's of a different colour. Right, and that is a wrap. Definitely, we'll get this lot taken down to the yard next time. And so, yeah, we will definitely be leasing the... So we've even got our cedars and everything ready for this particular year, which is quite amazing. So all that remains... No, I've said it already. Yeah, hopefully see you next session.